Ashhadu Ashhadu Alla Alla Ilaha Ila Illa Ila Allah Allah Wa Wa Ashhadu Ashhadu Anna Anna Muhammadan Muhammadan Rasulu Rasul Allah Allah MashaAllah I bear witness I bear witness That there is none that is known worthy of worship worthy of worship except Allah except Allah and I bear witness and I bear witness that Muhammad that Muhammad peace be upon him peace be upon him is his final messenger is his final messenger Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Allahu Akbar Alhamdulillah Rabbil Alameen just a quick question to scholar uh, we ask this question to everybody because we are so interested what attracted you to this deen to this Islam um, so I moved to Texas uh, last year around October, and um, I'm a little nervous, so just please, <laughs> okay. please bear with Take me. Take your time and rest. <laughs> they can wait, inshallah. <laughs> just to kind of give everyone a backstory about me, um, at six months old, I was put up for adoption, and I'm sorry, there was a good family who, who adopted me, and they put me in a Christian household, and for 28 years, I was just basically a product of Christianity and I found God through Christianity and it wasn't until October of last year where I lost everything that family had provided everything for me they provided a foundation they put me through college they gave me an opportunity I had a phenomenal job in corporate America and then my faith was tested when I moved to Texas because I wasn't used to not having everything but the foundation that they had provided for me put me on my knees basically and I started praying to God and asking for clarity amongst everything because I just didn't understand what back to your message about parents and respecting your parents I had did that all my life and they were just a foundation for me and then when I moved to Texas me and my friend we had started a roofing company and it wasn't going as well as I thought it should go and I, luckily God allowed an opportunity for me to meet Amir and I got with a good solar company and from there, he introduced me to this guy named Esau. And Esau sat down and spoke with me, and he asked me what did I believe. And I said, there's nothing greater than God. And he was just like, you're already a Muslim, and you just don't know it. And that's truly what brought me here, and it just feels good. And it just feels like it's the right decision. It's a lot stricter than Christianity, and I'm fine with that because... <laughs> I didn't like drinking and smoking anyway, and this just gives me more of a reason not to do that. And God has just been good to me, and I just hope that this testimony is good for anyone who's out here. And if you're just struggling, just believe in God and Allah, and everything will be fine. Allahu Akbar. Allahu Akbar. Well, Skyrim, this all this strictness, when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala prohibits something, 100%, without a speck of doubt, it's not good for us. And when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala asks us to do something, 100%, without a speck of doubt, it is the best thing for us. Maybe you will find out in this dunya, or maybe, or maybe we don't, but we have so much trust, is that He is the all-wise, and we put all our trust in Him. Welcome to Islam. May Allah make you a source for others to join this deen. Ameen, Ya Rabbil Alameen. Zakumullah khair.